camera rolling. Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about knowledge of wider learning and like how it's portrayed in like the world today and in like school and education and that. So, um, first of all, what is knowledge to you? It's a rhetorical question, so just think about it while I'm doing the presentation. Um, I'm going to start with saying, is knowledge just textbooks and whiteboards? Or is it, you know, exploring the world and thinking about what's going on in the world today? Because you could quite easily sit, sit in lesson and um, read textbooks, write down notes, and then just do that day to day. Or can you just like, or can you go out, explore things, and then have that knowledge, but doing it in a fun, or more exciting way and um, and then there's and then there's the insane education as well like you could quite easily just um, go home not go to school and sit on your iPad computer iPhone and look up things because the internet has everything or like or you can sit in class and listen <coughs> to a teacher and do you prefer not? It's more engaging if you listen to a teacher stand up here, give a presentation and talk to you, rather than sitting down on a copy and pasting things into a work document and then reading it ready for your exams or whatever. And then, now, when you're doing a piece of homework, has, you ever, has your teacher ever told you not to use Wikipedia while you're doing this, or not to use Google Translate? But then, people say, don't believe everything you read on the internet, but with Wikipedia, it's a reliable source because Everything on there has been checked and verified, otherwise they wouldn't put it out there for you to read. So then, what what's wrong with using it? Yeah, that's um, that's what I've really got to say. Do you have any questions? Yeah. What's your opinion on having iPads in school for learning? I think it's like my personal opinion. I think it's a lot better than just. Um, reading a textbook and that because with the iPad you can what within under 30 seconds research something and then take it down and know it rather than and rather than just using a textbook and it's like you can use it in such like a better like more interactive way as well. Why are you so passionate about knowledge? Because from my personal experience every, every, teachers have said that school is the key to like the outside world and that. But look at people like Alan Sugar. What's he look look what he's done with his life without having say an education. He's he's made millions, billions of being an entrepreneur and selling things without like his GCSEs or anything. Ben can I just ask you um, is there a difference between information and knowledge? I think so because there's information in textbooks and the internet but then you could have knowledge on other things you're passionate about like you could have knowledge on things like I don't know sea creatures and other like or world's um, world issues so I think there is a big difference yeah Um, do you think you're better off being successful at home or through school? I'm not saying that being successful in school like won't help you in later life, of course, because you can go on to university and then get good jobs that will support you through life. Mm. But then it's not it's not always like the key to succeeding in life. That's my personal opinion on it.